I cannot even believe that it is Fred's last day on the air and then I'm going to be sitting next to him. I met him when I was an intern on the Morning Exchange back in 1995. He was just the kindest, sweetest man who, by the way, was reading Playboy magazine. <laughs> and I thought, Fred Griffith, the classy Fred Griffith? And he looked at me and he said, there, there are good articles in this. <laughs> um, and then, really, pretty much every day of my career up until now, I've worked with him either as a producer or as a host. He is kind and he is generous. And in a world when um, this is a business that's so ego-driven, there was never any of that. And I just feel like Fred, and, and I'm going to tell him this today on the show, he has made me a better person for knowing him. And I, I love him, and I just feel so thankful to have known him in my lifetime. I love you, Fred. <laughs>